I too commend the bravery of the women involved in this case, but frankly, some of those women would not have required to have been brave if action had been taken. Yep. As a former police officer, I am disgusted and ashamed by what I have heard. But the um, Metropolitan Commissioner has um, said that 800 of his officers are under investigation. Has the Home Secretary required similar figures from other police mm -hmm. forces? What is the impact on the operational capability of police officers to do their business? And finally, as the Mother of the House rightly pointed out, eh, police officers are not employed. They are not subject to employment law. They are appointed. And actually, the staff associations within the police service, such as the Federation, play a very important role in yeah. disciplinary and conduct. So what engagement is the Home Secretary exactly. having with them? Well, the inspectorate reported late last year um, uh, into this issue, looking at forces all over the country um, and looking at their performance when it comes to vetting and monitoring of disciplinary matters when it comes uh, within policing. It, uh, the inspectorate made 43 recommendations, uh, largely focused at chief constables around England and Wales, the College of Policing and the MPCC. They've all been accepted. Uh, uh, they have to be, uh, there are deadlines for uh, spring of this year and then later of this year, and we're closely monitoring the implementation and delivery of all of those recommendations.